Welcome to another video installment Set the Pace Triathlon. I am Ryan Falkenress, www.setthepacetriathlon.com. This video we are going to go over how to calibrate and update your firmware for your Cyclops trainer, your Saris trainer. So first notice my trainer is not plugged in. The computer is not on. The only thing that is on is my phone. And I'm going to fire up the Saris app that I downloaded from the Play Store. I've got an Android. You can't tell by the Samsung up there at the top. So you fire up the app. So notice it's pretty simple. You need a profile. And then you calibrate or update the firmware. So I like to make sure the firmware is up to date. So notice it is searching for your trainer. So notice I've turned my watch off. So it's not communicating with the phone. I've got my computer off, I've got nothing synced to the trainer. I have restarted my phone so it forgot all the other Bluetooth devices. You know, if it's hooked up to your car, if it's hooked up to your refrigerator, your blender, your watch, whatever, you turn everything off that it's hooked up to, restart your phone. That way while it's looking, plug in your good old trainer. Light is clicking see if we can get it started without having to rotate the pedals notice it's not exactly the most exciting but there's the trainer checking the firmware now You are all up to date. Firmware is good. So for this, you need to get your old shoes on to calibrate. You actually need to get on your trainer. So I'm gonna let it find it. Hop on. Hopefully try not to lose you. Click in. It's found the trainer. I am clipped in. Connecting. I just got to hit the speed between 18 and 20 miles an hour. I'll give you a countdown. It's initializing, but the resistance is pretty much zero. Coast. Notice it's not too exciting. I'm not doing anything. I'm not pedaling. Just letting it coast. Calibration successful. So then you're done. Exit out of your app. And this is handy. So once you've done that, you're ready to go. Start your computer. Start back up your watch. Turn everything back on. This is going to be key if you're doing any of the Ironman virtual races. You need to calibrate your trainer right before the race start, and you need to have proof of that. So this is how you get updates on firmware and calibrate your Saris trainers. Got any questions about this process, put them in the comments of the video, email me or let me know, and I will help you out as much as I can.